Guys, I have to warn you all, this insane Elmos engine exotic assault rifle right now is absolutely broken because you can gain infinite amount of bonus armor without any cooldown whatsoever. This shit is absolutely insane guys. You can make yourself immortal and run around like a freak with easily 3 mil armor builds. In DZ this works unfortunately as well, although you are gaining a little bit less armor, but like I said, you can't be taken down with armor again and of course insane amount of armor with Elmos engine exotic assault rifle. In PV this is absolutely ridiculous because we have 2 million armor and we are not only stacking armor on ourselves, well not stacking but rocking bonus armor but also giving it to our teammates. They will constantly receive armor as well. Why this should not work like this? Because previously you could get bonus armor from galvanized talent only by using your skills or Scorpio shotgun at best case scenario. But Scorpio shotgun uh, will take some time because you have to apply all the stacks and after that the flag on your enemy will hang so you have to wait when enemy is free from your Scorpio shotgun stacks and then you can shock him again so it will take like 10, 15 seconds a window. The skills, same story, you can apply confused with skills but skills has cooldown but where the magic kick in, kick, kick, kicks in, excuse me, Elmos engine has no cooldown whatsoever with shock ammo, you have 70 bullets so each bullet will provide you with 1 a million bonus armor because perfect galvanized will give you 50% bonus armor and we have 2 million armor so it means we are running woo, woo, basically unstoppable but before we continue quick word from the sponsor Deeming.net if you don't have enough time or good teammates, but you still want to have all the best items in your game, then Leaving.net is set for you. They have absolutely amazing team on consoles, they will complete your order super quick. Everything happens through account sharing, this service has been working for many, many years. They have tons of customer reviews, you can check everything by yourself. But now with my promo code, everybody dip, you will have 15% discount on absolutely all service. Amazing deal, especially when right now they have some crazy sales going on. But now let's get back to this insane build. Guys, Bulwark with Perfect Galvanize is absolutely a powerhouse and use of course shield. Why? Because first of all, Bulwark gear set will provide you with some insane armor again. One of the best face tank setups in the game by far and now paired up with Perfect Galvanize where you can gain 50% your armor as bonus armor. Mm. Throw in the mix Elmos engine new exotic assault rifle which will give you 70 bullets with shock ammo and you need only one freaking bullet to apply shock effect. Look at this shit! Look at this! I mean... Mm, definitely this was not thought true because like I said previously we didn't have anything even remotely close to Elmos engine exotic assault rifle which can give you 70 shock bullets basically non-stop and like I said you need only one shock bullet to proc 1 mil bonus armor to yourself and teammates. For specialization here we will, we will use technician, we will gain extra skill tier, we will have of course uh, disrupt grenades, um, link it laser point attachment which we will use on our king break and aim with assault rifle with perfect flatline, one of the hardest hitting assault rifles in the game but this bad boy, this freaking bad boy paired up with boulevard gear set and perfect effing galvanized is cheat code. It is what it is man, like I said, it should not work like this because most of the time to proc galvanize you need to use Scorpio shotgun but to apply two shocks in a row it's not happening with Scorpio shotgun, it will take like 10 second window before you will be able to apply second time shock on the same enemy but with Elmos engine exotic assault rifle you have 70 bullets one bullet will proc shock, that will proc galvanize, galvanize has no cooldown whatsoever just think about that Yeet it, this talent can give you 50% bonus armor instantly without cooldowns. Thanks to God, you can't stack it. So you have to wait till the bonus armor will be down or taken 
out from you and then you can apply shock one more time or third time or fourth time or fifth time it's absolutely insane how i would play with this bulwark setup it's really simple i showed you also some highlights of this i am applying shock effect gaining bonus armor and then switching to my king breaker assault rifle with perfect flatline because it's amplified weapon and skill damage my catharsis mask is taken constantly by default by receiving all the incoming damage and I'm dealing more and more and more damage eventually when all the stacks will be full catharsis mask will release the cloud green cloud of heals not much but paired up with bulwark gear set it actually kinda decent in terms of your attributes it depends on your playstyle I'm rolling basically everywhere armor again on my chest piece I have hazard protection but I will re-roll it for uh, armor again you could go with crit damage crit chance mask it truly depends on your preference how you want to use your setup or go with hazard protection you have three options hazard protection armor again or maybe crit damage and crit chance and of course fourth one but by far the rarest one with skill damage and deflector shield. You could use skill damage attribute and use deflector shield because armor core attribute will be counted as skill tier to all shields. Deflector shield will be counted as well in the category, in that category. So yeah, you have a couple options how to run this setup, but uh, Catharsis Mask will give you the best damage boost. Chest piece will increase amount of Reapers we are gaining. Really nice chest piece, holster, knee pads, everywhere armor with armor again, and new backpack with perfect galvanized stand. I wish I could found one with armor regen on, and maybe skill damage or uh, both attributes, uh, armor regen and hazard protection. But uh, most likely, I will look definitely for crit chance and crit damage attributes. I will try to think some PvP crazy setups with this one, but. Damn man, in PV the amount of bonus armor, PV okay you are getting a little bit less armor, but still you can get on the fly the bonus armor, it's absolutely insane that it has no cooldown, Galvanized has no cooldown, I mean, mm, mm, and you can proc it basically from every vet. Of course your teammates will gain bonus armor if they are in 30 meter radius of the chalked enemy But goddamn 30 meter radius. It's basically whole effing battlefield map. It's huge This radius is absolutely huge it, Like I said this build feels like cheat code apply shock effect switch to your king breaker when bonus armor is has been taken down Go back to your Elmos engine exotic assault rifle, get again free bonus armor, switch to your king breaker, proc catharsis mask, it's super easy man. I mean this build, Jesus Christ, galvanize, catharsis mask, and Elmos engine, Jesus man. Ah, oh, this the synergy is absolutely amazing, I never thought that um, galvanize has no cooldown whatsoever as a talent. So for the skills I'm using Assault Turret, like I said a million times before, it has more health than Decoy, it will destruct enemies for longer, on top of that it will deal a little bit of damage, so overall Assault Turret is my preferred skill in DZ, of course Decoy is always an option, bye!